kidney, naphtali. During the third week, the lunar germ ascends from the coccygeal plexus through the left autonomic nervous system up to the region of the left kidney. The spleen is located on the left side of the body. We can assume that this is why Percival specifies the left kidney also. In the biology of Kundalini, Jaina Dixon says, tingles are felt, especially on the left side of the body. The tingles and bubbles are always associated with increased Kundalini flow. The kidneys are regarded as the body's most important reservoir of chi, life force energy. The root word in kidney is kid, meaning young goat. Kids are children. The inner child is the inner chai or chi, photon light precipitating as nitrogen, fire and phosphorus light, of which there is a noted amount in the kidneys. And I won't tell you the amount of dynamite we could make with all the nitrogen and phosphorus we could extract from a kidney. The bulk of nitrogen and phosphorus is stored in the kidney organ energy system, which includes the adrenal glands and the testes or ovaries. The adrenal glands sit like barrister wigs on top of kidneys. Judge not, lest ye be judged. The kidneys regulate the body's acid alkaline pH balance and we already know how important pH balance is toward the great regeneration due to the bipolar acid alkaline luni solar nature of every cell in the body. Pancreas, all creator. The word pancreas is composed of the two roots, pan meaning all, as in the all pervasive source of creation, and creas meaning to form. The pancreas is referred to as the bread pan, pantry or pannier, bread basket. It is innervated by the solar plexus, Bethlehem, house of bread. The pancreas is situated in the stomach, behind the navel, and secretes insulin. Insulin communicates with the genes and vitalizes DNA gene expression. Heart center, Jerusalem. Jerusalem symbolizes the great nerve center, just back of the heart. It is the Anahata cardiac plexus, formed by nerves from the cervical ganglia. The loves and hates of the mind are precipitated to this ganglionic receptacle of thought and are crystallized there. This is really important because love stimulates oxytocin release. The flow of the pituitary chemical oxytocin is enhanced by feelings of love and pure intention in the heart. Subsequently, CSF flow increases and pressurizes so that the pineal can upgrade melatonin. This will be explained more thoroughly later. The endocrine thymus gland is associated with the cardiac plexus. It is situated in the chest and begins to shrink when the genital organs develop. The majestic thymus stocks the body with lymphocytes, white blood cells, which are integral 
to the great regeneration as described earlier in the spleen section. Lymphocytes have the ability to travel freely through the body and are more abundant than any other of the body's wandering cells. The vibrations of the thymus have the ability to drive health or disease. What we love and what we hate here build cells of joy or of pain. In summary, feelings of love originating in the thymus cause the pituitary to secrete oxytocin and consequently the pineal can upgrade melatonin. The seed's journey then continues upward from the thymus to the thyroid, which is also innervated by cervical ganglia. Thyroid cervical vertebrae 4, the baptism. Jesus was baptized of John in the fluids, the Christ substance of the spinal cord. Dr. Carey says that the word John is a chemical formula. Let's unpack this. Jesus is said to be 30 years old when John baptizes him. Jesus' 33 years of life symbolise the 33 vertebrae in the human spine. Therefore, we know that Jesus' 30th year must correspond with the 30th vertebrae of the spine. This is C4, the fourth cervical vertebrae. The top of the thyroid gland is level with C4. The thyroid uses iodine, an electron donor, to produce thyroxine, a powerful hormone which disinfects all the channels of the autonomic nervous system while we sleep. Without this biological iodine, we would not be able to live. Thyroxine literally baptizes or purifies the body, mind and soul. And the letters which spell John, previously ion, are found in the chemical formula of thyroxine. In summary, the Jesus seed is baptised by thyroxine at C4. This leads us to the crucifixion. Double cross, crucifixion. Three years after his baptism at C4, Jesus is crucified at age 33. Vertebral level 33 is at the medulla, near the entrance to the cerebellum, where the double cross of crucifixion, transmutation, is situated. Golgotha is the base of the human skull, where the spinal cord meets the brain. At this point occurs a double nerve crossing made by Ida and Pingala and the vagus nerve. The crucifixion can actually be likened to an invigoration of potential. To crucify means to add or to increase a thousand fold. When electric wires are crossed, they set on fire all inflammable substances near them. When the Christed seed crossed the nerve at Golgotha, the veil of the temple fell and the generative cells of the body were quickened or regenerated. After its crucifixion, 
the seed's constituents enter the cerebellum, which is the tomb.